So, has anybody talked to Dr. and Mrs. Geller yet? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they left me a message. They should be here any minute. Where is the waitress? I'm starving. <laughs> it's a buffet, man. Oh, here's where I win all my money back. <laughs> so, I gotta talk to you. Sure. What's up? Right. Yeah. And until then, you are going to sing to me because the radio's broken and you are selfish, but you have a nice voice. Really? I don't... Sing! I want to rock and roll all night. <laughs> let, let, let me make it up to you, huh? Ground control to major talk. <laughs> Commencing countdown engines on. <laughs> Take your protein pills and put your helmet on. <laughs> yes, Stop, it. Stop it! Stop it! No! Now, this is unbelievable. Joey has been holding his breath for almost four minutes. <laughs> Nothing. Monica and I had a stupid fight. But you're still moving in together, right? Because my ad came out today. Wanted female roommate, non-smoker, non-ugly. <laughs> nice. Yeah? I just figured, you know, after living with you, it'd be an interesting change of pace to have a female roommate, you know? Someone I could learn from. Someone, someone who's different than me. And what's more different than me, a guy who's not 19, than, say, a girl who is 19. <laughs> <laughs> Not just a hat rack, my friend. <laughs> Any good mail? Yes, you got something from the Screen Actors Guild. Ooh, it's probably a residual check. Hey, uh, can you open it for me? I gotta see. Him. <laughs> Benefits lapsed. Hmm, huh, that's weird. I don't remember being in a movie called Benefits Lapsed. <laughs> okay, it's not a check. They're saying your health insurance expired because you didn't work it off last year. Let me see that. All right. Oh, I can't believe this. This sucks. <laughs> when I had insurance, I could get hit by a bus or, or catch on fire, you know? And it wouldn't matter. Now I gotta be careful? <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> Nothing. Well, I, I, I got this blinding pain in my stomach when I was lifting weights before, and then I uh, passed out and uh, haven't been able to stand up since. <laughs> but uh, I don't think it's anything serious. <laughs> This sounds like a hernia. You have to, you, you go to the doctor. No way. Okay, look, if I'm gonna go to the doctor for anything, it's gonna be for this thing sticking out of my stomach. <laughs> That's a hernia. But I have to start working out again. Damn you, 15s! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, will you grab me a cruller? <laughs> Sit down! <laughs> Joey, we're ready for you. Uh, Joey, this is uh, Alex. He's gonna be playing your son. Hi, Alex. And uh, as you can see, my hands are not in my pants. <laughs> Take 36 is up. <laughs> all right, let's try this again. You ready, Joe? Uh, one thing. Um, is it all right with you if I, if I scream right up until you say action? Uh, sure. Oh, action! Oh, I think good game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You just take a big, big swing, okay? Oh. Now, don't hold back. Okay. Hey! hey! What are you doing? We're just celebrating that Joey got his health insurance back. Oh, all right. <laughs> So the Porsche guy took his car back. <laughs> but you found the keys to his clothes? <laughs> no, I just, uh, I just love the way it feels when everybody thinks I own a Porsche. And people would think you own a Porsche because you're wearing the clothes? Of course. <laughs> Only an idiot would wear this stuff if you didn't have the car. <laughs> Did a Porsche throw up on you? <laughs> hey! Let's push up! <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna be moving out, so you are gonna be in charge of paying the rent. 
Right. And when does that do? First of the month. And that's every month? No, just the months you actually want to live here. Uh, okay, here's the phone bill. Oh, my God! That's our phone number. Joey Tribbiani does not take charity. Anymore. It's not charity, Joe. I don't know. Forget it. Okay? I mean, thanks, but I'm done taking money from you. All right, I can take care of myself. Now, what's next? Come on. Okay, uh, here's the electric bill. Mm. This is how much we pay for electric? Well, yeah. <laughs> so we'll do the rest of the bills later, then? Here it is. Our last pizzas together as roommates. Oh, I wish I'd known you were going to do that. I ordered Chinese. Oh. Well, that's okay. Hey, actually, in a way, it's kind of nice. You know, our last dinner together, me bringing the food of my ancestors, you the food of yours. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> so, uh, what, uh, what do you do? I'm a dancer. You're a dancer? <laughs> she, she's a dancer. Well, I think I'll go and unpack. Oh, oh. <laughs> Joey? Yeah. Did you even interview this woman before you asked her to move in? Of course I did. Uh -huh. What exactly did you ask her? When can you move in? <laughs> oh, I see what happened. <laughs> it's because I was trying to repel you, right? Believe me, you'd feel a lot different if I turned it on. I don't think so. Oh, I do. <laughs> How you doing? I'm okay. What? Oh, dear God. <laughs> it's not Joey. Hey, hey, look, I am still Joey, okay? Flowers, they're just, you know, they're nice to look at. And that happens to be a picture by a famous artist of a famous baby. <laughs> You're turning into a woman. No, I'm not. Why would you say that? That's just mean. <laughs> now I've upset you? What did I say? Not what you said, it's just the way you said it. <laughs> You guys think I have a chance with Janine? Oh. oh, honey, we have been through this before. Yeah, don't do this to yourself. She made it pretty clear it is not going to happen. Well, all right then. I guess I shouldn't get too excited about the fact that I just kissed her. Really? Yeah. Well, we'll see. You kissed her? Oh, we kissed it up real nice. <laughs> so you kissed her. So what happened after that? I came over here to tell you guys. <laughs> So she's just waiting over there for you? <laughs> this is great. Another Thanksgiving with nothing to give thanks for. Maybe I give thanks for you shutting up, huh? <laughs> maybe I have thanks by taking my PlayStation over to my new apartment. Well, maybe I love you. Hey, maybe. <laughs> it tastes like feet. <laughs> I like it. Are you kidding? What's not to like? Custard? Good. Jam? Good. Meat? Good. Oh, my God. Introduce us. <laughs> well, this is Chandler. Hi. And you know Monica and Ross? Hi, and that's you. Phoebe, and that's Joey. Hey, how are you doing? Don't! <laughs> Poor thing. So that story doesn't make you cry? No, look, I don't cry. It's not a big deal, okay? No, it's not okay. It's not okay at all. You're dead inside. Joey. Yeah? What I tell you about talking to your friends while you're working? Uh, do it? That guy's been waiting for his coffee for ten minutes. He's complained about you three times. Well, where was I? Hey, Chad. Just getting a soda. I'm Joey. How are you doing? Oh, no, 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 no. How you doing? What? How you doing? Damn it, Carl. Go wait in the hall.
Hey, uh, can I get a little piece of that cake? Pizza! We like pizza! Get out! <laughs> She's a student. Oh, is that against the rules? No, but it is frowned upon. I see. Besides, there's a big age difference. Oh, well, think of it like this. When you're 90... I know. You... When I'm 90, she'll be like 80, and it won't seem like such a big difference. No, that's not what I was going to say at all. <laughs> no, what I was going to say is when you're 90, you'll still have the memory of what it was like to be with a 20-year-old. <laughs> the last day of auditions is Thursday, okay? So I got to get in there by Thursday, okay? Just remember Thursday. Thursday. Can you remember Thursday? <laughs> Yeah, so Tuesday? <laughs> Thursday. Look, if you need help remembering, just think of it like this. The third day, all right? Monday, uh -huh. one day. Tuesday, two day. Wednesday, when? Huh? What day? Thursday. <laughs> the third day, okay? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> so? So? It's Thursday. How was the audition? Monday, one day, Tuesday, two day, Wednesday, when, one day, Thursday. Oh. <laughs> well, you, you don't look good, Joe. Well, the fridge broke, so I had to eat everything. Cold cuts, ice cream, limes. And, hey, what was in that brown jar? That's still in there? Not anymore. <laughs> Suppose we were a uh, divorced couple. Uh -huh. And I got custody of the kid, right? Now, suppose the kid dies, and, and I got to buy a new kid. <laughs> OK. Give me $400. <laughs> or you could just, you know. What the hell are you doing? What the hell am I doing? He just broke my fridge. That'll be $400. Joey, I saw you push him. Chan, remember I told you about our fridge? Uh-huh. I still haven't gotten the check for your half yet. Do not give him any money. I'm not talking to you. You broke my fridge. Joey Tribbiani, oh this is... Wow. He's so lifelike. <laughs> Unbelievable. This is Wayne, the man who created and operates cheese. How do you do there? Do you do? <laughs> so where's cheese? Cheese is right here. Nice to meet you, man. <laughs> <laughs> this is the, like the temporary robot, right? No. Why? Well, I, I just I just thought it was going to be like a really cool robot, you know, like the Terminator or uh, when I first saw you. I spent two years developing this machine. It's absolutely state of the art. I'm sorry. It just, I don't know, it doesn't really look like it can do anything. You can do this. Let me. Hey, Joey, I want to talk to you. Yeah, well, I don't want to talk to you, Wayne. I hate you. You ruined my life. Oh, Chandler, Wayne, Wayne, Hi. Chandler. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Joey, Joey, I, I'll get you your job back if you help me out. Why should I help you out? The reason he just said. What do you need? I, I saw you on stage talking to that beautiful woman, you know, Sarah. Mm -hmm. I wish I could talk to her. What, are you in love with her or something? Yeah, her, all of them, anyone. Yeah, I've been there, my friend. Listen, I, I guarantee you keep your job if, if you can teach me how to talk to women like you do. Oh, well, Wayne, it's not really something you can teach, you know? It's pretty much something you're born with. If you, you, you can teach it. I'll show you right how to do it. <laughs> what are you doing? Key's stuck in the lock. I can fix it. Hold on. Watch out, watch out. It still doesn't work. I'm not finished. Oh. <laughs> nice job, Joe. You're quite the craftsman. <laughs>
Hey, look, if I'm gonna go to the doctor for anything, it's gonna be for this thing sticking out of my stomach. <laughs> That's a hernia. I'm gonna have to start working out again. Damn you, 15s! <laughs> Hey, will you grab me a cruller? <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> Joey, we're ready for you. Uh, Joey, this is uh, Alex. He's going to be playing your son. Hi, Alex. And, uh, as you can see, my hands are not in my pants. <laughs> Take 36 is up. <laughs> all right, let's try this again. You ready, Joe? Uh, one thing. Um, is it all right with you if I, if I scream right up until you say action? Uh, sure. Oh, action! Oh, I think good game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You just take a big, big swing, okay? Oh. Now, don't hold back. Okay. Hey! Hey! <laughs> what are you doing? We're just celebrating that Joey got his health insurance back. Oh, all right. <laughs> So the Porsche guy and Monica and I had a stupid fight. But you're still moving in together, right? Because my ad came out today. Wanted female roommate, non-smoker, non-ugly. <laughs> nice. Yeah? I just figured, you know, after living with you, it'd be an interesting change of pace to have a female roommate, you know? Someone I could learn from. Someone, someone who's different than me. And what's more different than me, a guy who's not 19, than, say, a girl who is 19. <laughs> <laughs> Not just a hat rack, my friend. Any good mail? Yes, you got something from the Screen Actors Guild. Ooh, it's probably a residual check. Hey, uh, can you open it for me? I gotta see. Him. Benefits lapsed. Hmm, huh, that's weird. I don't remember being in a movie called Benefits Lapsed. Okay, it's not a check. They're saying your health insurance expired because you didn't work enough last year. Let me see that. All right. Oh, I can't believe this. This sucks. <laughs> when I had insurance, I could get hit by a bus or, or catch on fire, you know? And it wouldn't matter. Now I gotta be careful? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Nothing. Well, I, I, I got this blinding pain in my stomach when I was lifting weights before, and then I uh, passed out and uh, haven't been able to stand up since. <laughs> but uh, I don't think it's anything serious. <laughs> In a way, it's kind of nice. You know, our last dinner together, me bringing the food of my ancestors, you the food of yours. <laughs> huh? <laughs> so, uh, wh uh, what do you do? I'm a dancer. You're a dancer? <laughs> she, she's a dancer. Well, I think I'll go and unpack. Oh, wait, wait. Did you even interview this woman before you asked her to move in? Of course I did. Uh -huh. What exactly did you ask her? When can you move in? <laughs> oh, I see what happened. <laughs> it's because I was trying to repel you, right? Believe me, you'd feel a lot different if I turned it on. I don't think so. Oh, I do. <laughs> How you doing? I'm okay. What? What? Oh, dear God. <laughs> it's not Joey. Hey, hey, look, I am still Joey, okay? Flowers, they're just, you know, they're nice to look at. And that happens to be a picture by a famous artist of a famous baby. Hey. So, has anybody talked to Dr. and Mrs. Geller yet? Uh -huh. Yeah, they left me a message. They should be here any minute. Where is the waitress? I'm starving. It's a buffet, man. Oh, here's where I win all my money back. I gotta talk to you. Sure. What's up? <laughs> all right. Yeah. And until then, you are going to sing to me because the radio's broken and you are selfish, but you have a nice voice. 
Really? I don't... Sing! I want to rock and roll all night. <laughs> let, let, let me make it up to you, huh? Ground control to major tom. <laughs> Commencing countdown engines on. Take your protein pills and put your helmet on. Stop it! Stop it! No! Now, this is unbelievable. Joey has been holding his breath for almost four minutes. Dude, are you trying to kill me? No, I took his car back. But you found the keys to his clothes? <laughs> no, I just, uh, I just love the way it feels when everybody thinks I own a Porsche. And people would think you own a Porsche because you're wearing the clothes? Of course. <laughs> Only an idiot would wear this stuff if you didn't have the car. <laughs> Did a Porsche throw up on you? <laughs> hey! It's Porsche! <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna be moving out, so you are gonna be in charge of paying the rent. Right. And when does that do? First of the month. And that's every month? No, just the months you actually want to live here. Uh... Okay, here's the phone bill. Oh my god! That's our phone number. <laughs> Joey Tribbiani does not take charity anymore. It's not charity, Joe. I don't just... know. Forget it. Okay? I mean, thanks, but I'm done taking money from you. All right, I can take care of myself. Now, what's next? Come on. Okay, uh, here's the electric bill. Mm. This is how much we pay for electric? Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll do the rest of the bills later, then? Here it is. Our last pizzas together as roommates. Oh, I wish I'd known you were going to do that. I ordered Chinese. Oh, well, that's okay. Hey, actually, 